So Craig's always playing practical jokes on people, so this morning I thought I would take his sunscreen bottle and fill it with mayonnaise. He's always putting on sunscreen no matter what, even when he goes out to get the mail. So this morning before his run, he's in for a little surprise. Okay, he's in the parking lot. Good morning, everyone. Morning. So what's up with the camera today? Just uh, testing out this new lens. Testing out a new lens. So that's all right. I'm going to just check my email and go run real quick. So okay. I'll uh, get that done. Nothing major. I think it's kind of weird how you're filming me with that camera. Just put a little sunscreen on here before I go running. What's so funny? Oh. What is this? Oh. It's like man. It's like mayonnaise. <laughs> All of a sudden, I got a craving for like turkey and avocado and provolone <laughs> cheese. That's disgusting. <laughs> As you can see, Amber and I are going to have some conflict that we are going to have to resolve. It's important to know that conflict is natural. You know, maybe it's an un uh, a misunderstanding. Um, you know, maybe there was some intentional hurts. Uh, it could be that we just live in a dysfunctional system where it's impossible to avoid bumping into each other every once in a while. Uh, it's, we have to know and remember that uh, an imperfect person plus an imperfect person is always going to equal uh, an imperfect relationship. Uh, conflict is something that many of us avoid, but um, we have to know as well that conflict isn't going to work itself out unless we talk about it. So this Sunday morning at the water's edge, uh, we're going to talk about one of those topics that we avoid talking about, and that is conflict. We're going to talk about why and when and how uh, to resolve conflict in biblical ways. Um, we're going to talk about how to resolve and work out our differences with other people. So join us on uh, Sunday morning at Millard West High School at 9 o'clock or 10.30. And you can always check out our website as well uh, at watersedgeomaha.com. There we always have the most recent news, stories, events, and resources.